Hey, it's Stuart Olden from Variety. I'm here in Park City, Utah. As you can see, Main Street right behind me. Still a lot of action going on. Lots of films being seen. There's also a new festival director this year. John Cooper takes over. He's been with the fest for a long time. Recently caught up with him at the Eccles Theater. Let's, uh, let's hear what John had to say. This is my first year um, as director of the festival. I've been, I've been working for this festival for 21 years. So I think um, the best part about it, really, the most surprising thing is all the audiences that have turned out this year for independent film, because I wasn't really sure. You know, you're not really sure in this recession and everything who's going to show up for something like this. So that's been great. Um, one of the biggest challenges I had this year, I think, was going from a person that was sort of uh, maybe driving things a little more to actually listening more to other people and not just my staff in putting together the films but um, actually listening to the audiences and trying to hear what they say about the festival and match their expectations. Hosting is a big deal. I talk all the time that that's what we do. Once the films are selected, once we're here, it's all about making people comfortable. We try to worry about them, you know, in the lines and uh, and all that. We really we do intro introductions at the theaters for each one of our filmmakers. So I'm going to bring up um, our first time director, um, Philip Seymour Hoffman. <laughs> You, know, you never know when they're going to be a little nervous. It's a little hand-holding, but um, that's part of it. And, you know, we, we work a lot. We have a lot of events, too, where we try to get the filmmakers together to, um, to meet each other because it's a lot about community and the community of independent film. And being a part of Sundance, we want to automatically bring them into this larger group of people who sometimes work in isolation most of the time. This is a, a huge platform for not just presenting your work, but also for finding a buyer for your film. And that's a lot of what, even though we're not an official marketplace, this is where filmmakers hope to find buyers. But then there's a lot of other opportunities too, new ones in the technology world. There's, um, we've created opportunities for them to go right on YouTube and right on um, uh, video on demand for a split of the profit, for a direct split, which is actually a pretty good deal for an independent filmmaker. It's risk because you don't know where it's going to go, but, it, but they're all in complete control. So it's really that, you know, artist to audience connection. Mm -hmm.